What's up, everybody? So I run some tests on my MacBook Pro and then on my Hackintosh. There was one question in the comments, so I wanted to do this and see the results. I'm going to show the comparison on other Apple computers that you can buy and see how they, uh, you know. BruceX, I just compared my MacBook Pro with my Hackintosh. I got a really good result. Hackintosh was just 41 seconds to export that video, while the MacBook Pro was two minutes and nine seconds. So that's uh, a really big difference there. The other test I wanted to do is the Geekbench 64-bit single processor. For this one, at the beginning, I was like, well, I don't see that much difference, like, look at this, but then when I put it on perspective and I was looking at other uh, Mac computers, then you could say like it's a big uh, difference. And especially if you go to the Geekbench uh, top 10 computers, you have iMacs from 2017 and 2015. My Hackintosh would come second, uh, right after the 27 inch Retina mid 2017. Yeah, that's the one that just came out. Yeah, that's really good. And now that I see other computers, I think my MacBook Pro is still like it's still in the game, but yeah, my hacking touch is way better. So the other benchmark is the 64-bit multi-processor Geekbench benchmark. For that one, I almost got 19,000 and my MacBook Pro only 8,000. That's due to my MacBook Pro processor has two cores while my Hackintosh has four cores. That multiplies the performance when you do these uh, tests. Yeah, that's really good. If you go to compare what other Macs, if you put my Hackintosh there, it would be... So it's a really good result anyway. I'm really pleased with the results. I'm going to put the links in the description uh, of the Geek Benchmark, also where you can download uh, BruceX, so you can also do these tests and compare it with what I have. Also, I think th here the best thing to do is compare with, maybe if you already had a computer, then compare what you had, like to see if you are really getting something better. Sometimes it's like, uh, it seems like you're imagining things, like it's better, but I don't know how much, or like you can quantify that. And the other thing is that you can also go to uh, Geek Benchmark. I'll put that in the description as well. Like you can go to the you can go to the ranking and then see all the other Macs and compare your Hackintosh with those Hackintoshes. And that's it. Yeah. Thank you for watching.